welcome in our technical channel in this session we are going to talk about printers how to install local printer and how to install network printer so if you have not subscribed this channel yet please subscribe this channel to get latest technical videos so let's start it start device and printers Add a printer. Okay, so what type of printer do you want to install? Local printer or network printer? So, first we are going to install a local printer. Choose a printer port. It can be USB, LPT or COM. So please make sure you're choosing the correct port because you won't be able to get the printouts from your local printer if you will not use the correct port. So please make sure you're choosing the correct port. So my local printer is connected through LPT port. Click next. install the printer driver you can see the list of printers choose your printer hp so my local printer is hp laserjet 2300 so hp is the brand and here you can see the list of drivers so my local printer is hp laserjet 2300 is here if in case your driver is not available in the list you can use have a disk option and you can download that from the internet you can browse from here or if you have CD drive you have DVD drive you can also browse from here next so use the driver that is currently installed recommended next if you want to change the name you can change from here so I'm going to change the name of my local printer it is my local printer click next so now it is installing my local printer please make sure you're choosing the correct port while you're installing your local printer so if you want to share your local printer you can share from here and if you do not want to share this printer click here next so you have successfully added your local printer if you want to get a test page click here finish so local printer has been installed successfully please make sure you're choosing the correct port while you're installing your local printer so now we are going to install our network printer add a network printer so it is searching for network printers it is searching for available printers we are not going to search from here choose the printer that I want is not listed add a TCP IP add a printer using a TCP IP so we are going to install a network printer through IP address through TCP IP address click here next device type choose TCP IP enter your network printer IP address so my network printer IP address is 192.168.1.1 one and please make sure you're connected with that network printer type a command go to your command prompt start C go to command prompt 
type a command ping p i n g your network printer ip address which is 192.168.1.1 to make sure that we are connected with that network printer so we are getting reply from the network IP that means we are connected with that network printer click next so now it is detecting that IP port here you can see that the reply which we are getting from the network IP from the network printer IP okay so it is detecting that IP port So additional port information required. Please make sure your device is turned on, means your network printer is turned on, please make sure. And your network is connected, so we already checked through ping command, we are connected with that network printer. And the device is properly configured. The address on the previous page is correct. Click next. So now it is detecting the driver model. Please make sure you are using the correct network IP address. Please make sure your network printer IP address is correct and you are also installing the correct printer driver of your network printer. So now it is detecting that driver model. So please make sure you are installing. Additional port information required. The device is turned on. Please make sure your network printer is turned on the network is connected so we already checked through the ping command we are connected with that network printer the device is properly configured and the address on the previous page is correct click next so now it is detecting the driver model please make sure the IP address which you are using that is correct because if you will not use the correct IP you will you will be not so if you will not use the correct IP address you won't be able to get the printouts from your note from your network printer so please make sure you are using the correct IP address because you won't be able to get the printouts from your network printer if you will not use the correct IP address so now it is detecting that driver model so here you can see that we are getting reply from the network IP so install the printer driver so now we are going to install the driver of our network printer so my network printer is HP LaserJet 4300 so HP is the brand and here is the list of drivers okay so we have HP LaserJet 4300 series driver here if in case your driver is not available in the list so you can download from the internet and you can use have a disk option you can browse from here or if you have CD drive you have DVD drive you can also browse from here 
password. Next, use the driver that is currently installed recommended. Next, if you want, you can change the name of your printer. So I'm going to change the name. This is my network printer. So now it is installing my network printer. Again, please make sure you're using the correct IP address and you're installing the correct driver of your network printer because you won't be able to get the printout from your network printer if you will not use the correct IP address and if you will not use install the correct driver of your network printer. So if you want to share this printer, you can share from here. And if you do not want to share this printer, click here. Next. So you have successfully added your network printer. If you want, you can use this printer as a default printer. And if you do not, click here. If you do not use, use this printer as a default. <coughs> so you have successfully added your network printer. If you want to use this printer as a default printer, click here. And if you do not want to use this printer as a default printer, do not click here. And if you want to get a test page, click here. Finished. So now you can see that both printer has been installed successfully. This is my local printer, which is HP LaserJet 2300. And this is my network printer, which is HP LaserJet 4300. So when you're installing your local printer, please make sure you're choosing the correct port. And when you're installing your network printer, please make sure you're choosing the correct IP address and you're installing the correct driver of your network printer. So if in case your network printer IP address has been changed, due to XYZ reasons so you can instead of installing that printer again you can just change the IP address of your network printer so go to your printer properties go to your network printer properties okay so here you can see go to port so my network printer is 192.168.0.1 that is the IP address of my network printer and if in case due to XYZ reasons my print network printer IP has been changed so I can instead of installing that printer again I can just update the IP address add a port TCP IP new port enter your new IP address which is 192.168.0.2 next so now it is detecting that IP port And if you have not subscribed this channel yet, please subscribe this channel to get latest technical videos. So make sure your network printer is turned on, your device is connected, your network is connected, device is properly configured, and the address on the previous page is correct next finished close so you can see that new IP has been added apply
so apply and closed okay so both printer has been installed successfully if you have any concern if you have any confusion or if you have any suggestion please ask in comment box thank you very much for watching and if you have not subscribed this channel yet please subscribe this channel bye bye